Welcome back everybody, it's me, GSD, back again with some more Least of the Unbreakable. Blood and Sweat Socks Edition, Chapter 1 of 2 Part something. Uh, we got stuff to do. We got people to see, people to see us. We're gonna get interviewed. And then, I think there's some other spots that we need to go to, but let's do this. We gotta save right outside. If anything goes wrong, we're covered. The interview. Starring Tim McCoppin, directed by Mr. Gould. Scheduled for now. So good. we're famous. Yeah. Hit the lights. Set the mood. <laughs> That's better. And now I enter. Thus begins another wondrous production on the set of Mr. Gold. Timothy, my sweet prince. All the aisles have been abuzz, waiting, wondering. Whoa. Last week a road warrior rolled into town and checked our Mr. Silver into the Heartbreak Hotel. Yet all he took was a handful of change and a boat ride to the Shogun's palace. That road warrior lived only in our memories until now, Timothy. Happy days have brought you back to our doorstep. If you're talking about me, this is the first time I've heard about this. No, hold on. Maybe the second time? Shh. Wait an answer. What we've, what we've all been dying to know is, who is... Tim McCoppin. What drives him? Who is his daddy? And what does he do? Who is your daddy and what does he do? So. Go on. Let the world know. That's kindergarten cop, isn't it? The cameras are rolling. Um. Just about me. I guess I can let you in on what I'm about. My name's Tim Alvin McCoppin. Recently, I think I've lost my memory of the last few weeks. That's all that comes to mind. Oh, my dear. I can already see the title of, our, of your first biopic. Lost in Cleveland, an amnesiac washes up on the shore and has to piece it together. What follows is a story of love, blood, and sweat socks. It all comes around. But first, we need to go deeper. Timothy, our prospective star, reach deeply into your past. Tell us where it began. What shaped you into who you are? My friends and I grew up in the little town of Abbott's Wake, just outside of Oloth. I like that town. Three blocks from the school, the laundromat had a pair of arcade machines. Every summer, they would change them out for new ones. And every Thursday, we'd wash my buddy's clothes and spend quarters on those machines while we waited. That town was a little bit of a dying shithole. A lot of us were looking for better prospects. There's a lot of tension over guys wanting to escape somewhere better. Then the world ended and it wasn't a problem anymore. My friends and I just ended up living together after that. Or, most of us did. And it's been that way ever since. And Timothy, as you think deeply, what from that dark time did you bring with you today? What? Uh... Well, if it means anything to you, I'm really quite angry. Anger? Fascinating. Over what? Can I speak candidly? Of course. I should have been a star, man. That's what it's all about. We could have been stars that way, I mean... There came a point where my buddy and I would talk about it every day. 
just had to find the right opportunity. I go straight to the top and we'd be there. Like a rocket with my buddy in tow. You feel me? I could have gotten us out of that town. And if it's any different to you, it hurts me that I never could. Day before it all ended, some of us left and some of us stayed. And my ex-buddy, I mean, we were still buddies, but he's just somebody to me now. Somebody should have been brought along like the rest of us. Somebody got left behind and ain't never been the scene again. Let me tell you something. Mean G. If you and everyone want to know what drives Tim of M A. McCoppin, is that it's that ever since that somebody parted ways, this has all been a bad dream. But there's the hope that somewhere out there is a place. The place that used to be the little town of Abbott's Wake. And that maybe, just maybe, that somebody who got left behind is still there. And Tim's gonna find him and bring him along. Right behind him like things were meant to be. Can you dig it? Timothy, baby boy, I can dig it. I know exactly who you are. Perhaps it feels to you like you're seeking to reclaim things all gone, like tears and rain. But I see the meaning behind your words. Timothy Alvin McCoppin, I can make you into a star. Everyone, a round of applause for our sweet Timothy. Am I going to get jumped? A round of applause if you wouldn't mind. Keep clapping. Good enough. Let's hit the road. What? Hey, my party grows even stronger. That sucked. What? I'm coming to get you. Comfy chair for you. The interview starring Tim McCoppin. Directed by Mr. Go. Schedule for now. Can't go in there. Hey. Silver can always weasel his way out of being number two. Gold can navigate the Hollywood social scene with ease. Mercury can infiltrate any social structure without being unnoticed. I could go on. This is all just one big joke to me. I'm Mr. Copper. I conduct electricity. Yeah, yeah, yeah. We already talked to you. Bar. Where'd the guy go? One, two, okay. He's gone. No, I don't want to buy anything yet. Stop! Alright. I guess he's on gun? Nah, I need to check something. We have 19 mags. I bought the thing, right? The items. Wait, I just need to check uh, Clive. Yeah, I bought the keycard reader. I'm very curious. I hope it doesn't waste my keycards. All right, well, we did that. I guess we're going this way. But we should also actually check up on Spike. I'm coming, Spike. Eh, there's nothing here. This guy again. Uh, he's not in here. He's... Eh. No. Yeah. Oh, we can't get in there without uh, paying the toll, huh? Damn, it's still raining. Time to leave, I guess. Uh, I just gotta figure out how to leave. Well, it looks like we got only one way to go. Right. Anything here? No. Anything here? No. Who is you? Rain or shine, it's my job to stand here. But I'm not getting paid enough to stop you. Come on in. The hell are you? Paint? Sorry, we ain't finished painting the whole island yet. Still got the rest of the building and the boss's office, you know? I'm not going in the next room, though. Silver hired some kind of super assassins. I want to see him fight them counter-assassins that run the bar outside. Counter-assassins. We have an item. 
I can't remember what it's called. They gave us something to help with the fight. It must be a key item. Uh, uh oh. I forget what it is. Silver! No, I have Osiris! I don't, uh, an implement of truth's eye kung fu. All right. And we have Apple of Winter still, but I'm gonna hold on to it just now. Oh, uh, let's save because I might get killed and I don't know really how to operate with this group just yet. Well, I'll use a fuzzy crow. We ain't getting any more saves now from what I'm seeing because the guy's out of commission. All right, let's do it. Squall is a chode? No, Squall was an okay character. I like Squall. I like Final Fantasy VIII. That's when I told the fisherman it would be a little more complicated than that. Ha! Good one, bro. What? Oh, never mind that shit. Oh, it's those guys Silver's looking out for. I think it's time to play a tune, brother. Like only we can, broski. This is straight ass from... What is that from? It's not Kung Fu Hustle, right? It's not from Kung Fu Hustle. Or is it? Okay, well, hold on there! What the hell? He's following me. It's a good thing we... <laughs> it's a good thing we saved. Alright. Take two. I can't remember what movie I've seen this in. You go up quickly, and you go across, and you run, and you go down! Don't let him touch you! Don't let him take your shine! Give me that toy rifle. Go down! <sighs> Stick here for a second. We got Fat Man. It might be equipment for the man. Susie, no. Flourish, no. Toy rifle. Hello? Who's that foe? Um, weapons. Oh, we also got Peace Shooter. Who's this for? I wonder if it's for Mr. Gold. We didn't even look at Mr. Gold yet. Hold on. I'm sorry, my dude. Oh, it might be for... For this guy, Oswald. Showstopper, pea shooter. Violet tux and a tinted glasses. All right. And Mr. Gold. Gold nine, pea shooter. But we got toy rifle, so what the hell? Where? Who uses that? Uh, none of these would be good for you. Uh, no. Everybody using that dusty rose. And let's take a look at some of these skills now. Oswald, I don't think I... I did... I did look at you. Mr. Gold, though. Gold finger bim. A beam of willpower drawing on the power of gold increases in strength the more mags you have... Ooh, you sell? Oh my god. If you sold everything, you just have this guy pop one off and everybody's done, so. Top gun. Fire off six shots. More than enough to kill anything that moves. Direction. Casting call. Look at your cast of actors. Restore 15 to P TP per enemy in the battle. Lights. Put the hot spotlight on a target. They'll both deal and receive double damage. Ah! Uh, action. Yell into the megaphone. May make enemies panic. Nervous enemies are much more likely to, or something. Uh, and the camera. Point a camera at an actor to make them nervous, making them susceptible to your direction. Oh, so this, this makes this better. This, I don't know. Can you use this on both party members? I, like I could put that on Fat Man, have Fat Man fly up, and then Fat Man do his thing without getting touched. Be cool. Alright, uh, I don't know how to get through there without, you know, taking some damage. 
guess we're gonna have to take the two. Oh, I just jump over. That didn't do shit! I can see your stupid crap, morons. Okay, skip the rest. Just go ham, bro. Uh, here's a special attack. Here's our Gong Shogun's Imperial March. Oh, wait. The eye is probably showing me the swords. If you didn't have the swords, you probably would have been destroyed. This is Shogun's Knuckle. Well then. Let's hit him up with a regular. Clive, what you got? Accumulator. Suck up various debris laying around the area. You can find goods this way. Clive. Gideon. Fast ball. He's got 8,000. Hit him with the that, and then Fat Man... I guess float, because... Randro with powers of resistance. Just like stance. Hello? What the hell? Uh. DB. <laughs> I've found an empty bottle. That's good, actually. That, uh. What is this? Sorry. Shogun's Militia. Shogun's Militia, Shogun's Knuckle. Get rid of the Militia first. DDSA. New accumulator again. We can get more bottles and throw stuff at them, I guess. Not fastball. Let's use... Something nice. Add an extra attack to your turn. Huh? Makes all enemies prior confused. All foes. Do it. That's got to be worth it, right? Starfinger. No, we want Wyvern Palm. Knocks opponents dizzy. That's AoE, baby. Why is there so many people? D. D. S. A. Crying, confused, crying, crying, crying. Hopefully that makes them miss. Empty bottle. Yeah! I need somebody to take the heat off of this dude, though. Uh, we got... Wait! I can take the heat off of these guys! Where is it? No, it was... Beckon! Goes up TP while enraging an enemy? Oh, uh, don't do that. Let's see here. We don't have anything AOE... Uh, actually, item. I think a fire bottle... Might be good. Where is my fire crap? Fire bomb. Yeah. Save that for Clive. We'll use Tim to actually knock some heads around. Uh, Shogun's militia. Yeah, we'll use Sako. And we'll do Frankensteiner, which is W W A A on the militia. Clive, throw a fire bomb. Gideon, tension relief yourself. Fat man scoop, hit them up with the dragon palm. Can make opponents dizzy. Is this everybody? No. That's a siphon, misdirection. A drill and punch to, to the midsection. This is one person, this is all peoples. Hit them all. W, W, A, A. Frankensteiner, yeah. Nice, 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 nice. Bam! I'm all right with this. We're doing all right, actually. And we got the burn status on him. Hit. Not the Shogun. Get rid of these guys. Leave the confused dude. Leave that guy. Eh, hit the archer back there. Clive, suck up more crap. And we'll use skills. Diamond cutter. What does telekinesis do? Adds an extra attack. We don't want to do that just yet. 
We're doing pretty good. You're burning, you're dead. You're dead. So, let's focus on the guy at the end. Actually, don't even do that. Focus on the middle guy. You know what? I'm gonna change up what I did. Just focus on him. Clive, I want you to accumulate again. We're going to telekinesis on ourselves. We're going to float. Light stance. Good to get me some extra money, actually, because he's just getting a bunch of items. Look, burning the longer days. Okay. Well, Fat Man's gonna get rid of these guys anyway, so it's okay. Uh, we are going to focus on the Shogun's Knuckle. Live, do your thing. We're going to. Uh, oh, we got two. We can do two things, actually. So let's heal up with a Trout Jerk. Quick little chat. Wait, why is it not letting me do it twice? Okay, well, let's do this. I thought I did this as an extra attack after your turn. Muscle twister. You're still burning. You are not burning. You are confused. Alright, I gotta change up what I'm doing again. Because this guy needs to go. I'm gonna accumulate. Skills. We're going to trout you and Fat Man Scoop. Oh, I remember why I didn't do it because I was good, just gonna do this. Fat Man Scoop will do his thing, but we need to heal. Uh, regular attacks. We don't need to work that much. Found some perfume. Yeah. about it. Hit him regularly. Accumulate. This is like the perfect opportunity for Clive to get like extra gear or, and items for us. Skills. Technique Twister. Use your special attack against them. And we'll shoot. It's alright. Regulate. Didn't find anything. That man's pretty strong, man. No longer telekinesis is. Get more gla uh, gadgets. Gadgets. Muscle twister. That man shoot. Beef. <laughs> Street right there. And we got a level on Fat Man? Hell yeah, million dollar dream! Iced coffee. Got him. I think we shredded one too much. I hope you're I hope we're insured. What'd you get? Don't mess with me. GSD. I guess I could have fought them before going after that thing and then gotten after I beat them, but it's all right. I just need to heal, dude. I don't have enough mags, but we did get a battery and whatnot. I feel like I could go and fight a bunch of snakes on Big Island and get uh, extra gear. Please tell no one. All right. Hello. What's up? Mr. Silver's tastes in his kittens are highly refined. I hope he appreciates me. Spare a light? Can't help you. That's okay. Can't help you. What is that behind you? Oh, it's an umbrella. It's just broken. I suppose there's eyes when you've seen this. Put it in feel like staple. Yeah. Yeah. How many posters do I have left? 
Was that the last one? No. One more poster. One more. Big. Excuse me. Apologies. Mr. Silver won't be seeing any visitors at this moment, and I'm sure you've heard from up front. Though you're rather lucky, his schedule is clearing up rather quickly, and he'll be ready to meet you very soon. Perhaps you'd like to wait in here while I show these ladies through. I'll return with Silver's permission if that's what you'd like. Sure. Can I get you a drink while you're here, Monsieur Coppin? Coppin. Soda on ice. More than just a soda, my friend. That comes from Silver's private reserve of crystal cola. For a distinguished visitor such as yourself, we can spare a can. Sweet. Prize can of a special koala. You put it back down. Is something wrong? I'm not a coppin. I'm a... Uh, uh... Tell me your name is Dr. Raphael Ambrosius Cousteau. Ah, uh, Dr. Raphael Ambrosius Cousteau. What? But he told me to look out for... You were waiting on us? Oh, fuck off, grasshopper. Oh no! Oh no! Why are you hitting my man like that? Rough. Jacques de Gordon. Hit him regular. Clive, do your thing. Uh, Gideon. What is this guy about? Hit him with a fast ball. And we'll, uh... What is this? Shine your wristwatch. The smell of money makes enemies drop more mags and gives a special defense up. Ooh. <sighs> That'd be great, but we got Clive in the party. He's gonna get us some trash. So let's hit him up with the light stance. Uh, yeah, light stance. Uh, and we will BDSA. Almost. Attack down. Battery found. Floated. Now. Now. Nice. That... Man, Gideon reduced his attack like crazy. Hit him up with the SDW. Accumulator again. The special will hit you with the... Silencer. We need some TP though. Might hold off on the silencer. Let's hit him up with another fastball for now. We don't need to work. He's not... I'd rather him be... Uh... Dazed first. <clears throat> Wait, is he dazed? He might already be dazed. Empty bottle. <clears throat> Weird. Is he dazed? He is dazed. I'm a fool. Sako, let's hit him up with the power bomb. A W W A. Mandible claw. Accumulator. Not that. Diamond cutter. And siphon some SP. See if that works for us. A dub dub A A. Mmm. <laughs> Yeah. Perfume! Weird and wary in defense down. That would have been great, eh? Huh? That's not bad. Clive's not really doing any attacking. He's just gathering stuff for me. Uh, right now, I do want to hit him, but I don't have any power, and we need to encourage ourselves. Clive, do your thing. Pitches can't do skills. We can't really do anything. So hit him up with a fastball. Fat man scoop. Did we siphon? Can't remember if it worked. But we can. Spiral punch. Nice. Trout jerky. Mm. To McCoppin, we'll do an SDW. Accumulate. I have no 
SP, and I'm not using a, a thing mid-battle. We're just gonna get rid of him and then we'll go and like heal up, I guess. Uh, SDW. Get a BAM on him. BAMed. No BAM. Attack down. Empty bottle. We can throw a bunch of stuff at him because we got bottles out the ass now. And we can... Do we have anything that's chin? Eye beam we can still do. Hit him up with that. Get me more stuff, please. Throw a bottle at him. Empty bottle. 27. Yeah, hit him with that. And, uh... We'll, uh... We'll drag him. SDW. Nice hits! Me and my big mouth. That was a hard battle only in that I didn't have resources. 800. Gear lock. Whiskey, Coca Cola, Cola, Lola, and 21 mags. Deaded. Give me those drinks. Spare light, can't help you. I'm gonna go and heal. I will use the, the thing because I do not have enough resources to waste on just like sitting around doing that. I'm going to go and just use the, the thing. We got two batteries. We can sell those. That's not bad. This guy again. Uh, it was, we were you, it was, uh, here. He rest. Yeah. Ah, uh, feeling good, feeling great, feeling great, feeling good. How are you? You don't have to worry about us no more. Probably okay. Nothing left in here. Nothing here, nothing here, okay. For your stay. Nope. We wanted to... We can't leave leave yet, right? No. Gang is still there. How come the keycard thing is not working? Uh, equipment. Clive. I guess Clive is not really a good... Key card reader. Accumulator. Space can read key cards to trigger unusual effects within this computer matrix. I it's not doing anything. Does it have to be in the main hand? Equipment. Or is it like an item that I need to use with him? If I come over here, I can talk to you and I can sell this crap. Yeah, batteries are 25. How much does a battery sell for if I just sell it, like, can I not sell it? Battery. 10. All right, all right, all right, all right. How much is the apple? 150. Briefcase of love, we get 360. We can get a better deal for that, though. Joy, 10. Not worth it. Fuzzy Crow 10? Very much not worth it. We could sell, like, armor and, and crap as well, actually. Yeah, 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 we can. We got a lot of stuff that we can sell. Broken Boomerang, 11 mags, Electro Wristbands, keep that just in case, combat knife. Hey, I don't have anybody that uses the knife! Yet. I might find somebody. Um, I don't want to sell anything yet, just yet. We're still fine. We can buy, like, Coca-Cola, Coca -Cola from that vending machine as well. We still have a couple quarters, but maybe we can get more. Um, let's get back inside there. Don't run off the edge, please. Thank you. Alright, we're back. We're in this. I like uh, having Clive in the party. It kind of switches things up a little bit. It's not the gr like. I don't think he's really. Uh oh. They don't give you the gang poster in case unless something 
bad is happening. That's a silver door or a regular door, and this is a door with a gold handle with the gang sign in it. We'll go up here first. Hell yeah, baby! Fuzzy Crow. Hey, brother, it's pretty it was pretty tough sneaking back here. We do actually need... Oh, we can't even buy this. We have 10 mags. Got a good amount of perfume. Five. I mean, we have alcohol, but... Right now, we're kind of hurting. It's locked shut. Damn. Checking, checking, nothing. Checking, nothing. All right, hit this up. Might not be the party that we want to go in with, but we can... We got crows. We just got another one. Do it again. Another cheeky little save. Ooh, take that. Oh, la 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 la. More bottles. Into the abyss. Nothing, 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 nothing. Go. Nothing, 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 nothing. Huh? Huh? I see my character over here. Nothing. Can you go down? No. Down, no, down, no, down, no, down. There's something over here. Why would they put the fence there? Up, 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 up. Nothing. All right, we'll maybe come back to that. Big. Rain or shine, it's my job to stand here. And Silver pays me fairly enough to take my job seriously. I wouldn't go inside if I were you. The warlords are mean. Especially not through that hole in the roof. All right. I won't do that then, but I just want you to know that with this rain and, you know, that hole up there, it's probably not the most comfortable meeting. Eh? Checking, 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 nothing, nothing, nothing. Weird. The dock over here. You can leave. It's locked, you'll need a key. What about this? Can I blow this up? No. Danger. Up. Ugh! What's in here? I thought that was dull for a second. Have I? Wait. Oh, they're different. Hello? I haven't seen you on the docks. Get out. Dolphin bark. What? Dolph? Bark? You guys! You came back to visit me after all that happened? Sorry, boss. We're just following this guy around. Oi! We don't want to be friends again. Oi! Sorry. Depression? Wait, he's got... What is on his hand? Is that a sock as well? Who's this? This is... Jeremy Humphrey. Gabrielle T. Gray. Otis Humphrey. Alright. Start from... Here, then... Here, and then save you for last, because you have... Like, something that's wrong with you that I don't think we need to worry about. Why is my SP... Not fully charged. What the hell happened here? Uh, gadgets. Accumulator. So... Hold on. Cards? No. Items? It wouldn't be here, because you can't access your weapons. Toy rifle, though. Oh. So I've left this here. It looks like it's still jammed. Save that for, like, when we're doing our thing on, like, a real boss, I guess. Pitches! Skills! We're gonna silent- we're gonna do the face wash to everybody, but I want to see what we're working with. Eh! I don't think I'm worried. Gear lock. This odd striking pitch prevents an enemy from gearing up. Ah! Uh, what? 
Face Blaster, though. Fat Man Scoop! Hit him up with the Wyvern Palm, please. Uh, we're not gonna do anything because Fat Man gets a better chance of dazing people. Whoa, with that beam. Crying, confusion, crying. Trout Jerky. Slam, dazed. Where'd he go? Did he run? No, he's right there. You ain't going nowhere. He's confused. Hit this guy, Tigre. Accumulator. Gideon. Do we have anybody that's the, like that needs it? You need it. You definitely need it. Take that. Scoop them up. Again. Uh, SDW. Bam. Nice. Why is my Bem so strong? Perfume. Scooped. He's airborne. You can get him. Ow. Get you back down here. What was it? Is Red Moon? Slams an airborne enemy down. Instantly dazes somebody. No. Moon. Random targets. We don't want that. We want DDA. DDA. It was DDA, right? It's not DDA. It's DWWA. On you. Gadgets accumulator. Gideon. Alright. You're almost dead, so we'll get rid of you and then we'll get rid of you. But, uh, let's actually tension relief ourselves. Batman Scoop. Dragon Punch him. Crap, I forget what was it. D W W A. Yeah! And the crutch is gone and you missed your idiot, Tim. Holy crap. These guys have like no health, but they're hitting so hard. We need to get our crutch back, because Tim couldn't get the guy down. Five. I don't know. Keep doing this because I need stuff. But you? You need to heal, dude. Regular trout ass jerky on you. And dragon palm again. The AoE damage is still pretty good. Couldn't find anything. Nice. Fuck you, big bro! Geared up. Airborne depression gone. Uh, he's no longer airborne, but I don't think we can kill him. I'll try. Hit you up like that, Clive. You do your thing. What has he got left? This odd striking pitch prevents an enemy from gearing up. Crap. Gear up. It's a good thing that I saved. Gear lock. I don't know if that's actually going to work. Stance. Light stance. Oh, it worked! It actually worked! Um... SDW. I'm liking the damage on my Bam, man. Samon Jerky! Now, now we're talking. Oh, man. Nobody's dead dead, though. That's okay. We can still get him. We just don't know how much he's got left. Sako, Mandible Claw. Clive, accumulate. I don't know. Do this. A W W A A. You two used to be the best. Rock is for life. Set my own jerky. Extorting, extorting. How much mags am I gonna get for getting rid of this guy? It's about, uh, we can still do... We can do Frankensteiner, WWA. Frankensteiner on him, Clive. Keep getting me Sam on. And uh, we'll use Starfinger, I think. Oh, crap. Uh... 
What was it? WWAA or was it AWWA? WWAA. Crap. I thought I did the, the thing. Couldn't find anything. Weird and wary, got some SP drain. Oof! We can power bomb. Get him. Gadgets. Can't skill. We can shoot. A W W A A. Nice. I can't even remember what I'm doing here. Phew! I got another level up. Airlift. 36 mags. May I have a look first? Huh. Give it. The ruler. What is the ruler? Equip monk. No. I'll check for this stuff first. The ruler. No. 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 Nope. Damn, man. Who's this for? Definitely not you. Your wristbands. Your wristbands. Maybe you. No. Armbands. Glove. Armbands. Who the hell is this for? Is it a weapon? The ruler. It's a gun. You can measure a man's worth by the size of his gun. Uh, that's probably for Mr. Scoop, then. Wait, no. It's for Oswald. Yeah, yeah, yeah. 50. Oswald and Mr. Gold can use it. And it's just a straight-up in increase. Hit me up with that. Nice. I need to heal. Badly. I think I'm gonna end it here. Thank you, everybody. Thank you for joining me. And I'll see you next time in the next episode of Lisa the Unbreakable. Blood and Sweat Socks Edition Chapter 1 of 2.